Good morning, good morning. Up, cl up close and personal with the chickens. Uh, yes, I'm having my coffee with the chickens this morning. Why? Because I like to see the chickens, see how they're acting, see how they're looking. I check their eyes, their ears, their feet, make sure they're not all scaly and what have you. Look at these, aren't these some good looking babes? Yes, I even put some corn on the table for them. And of course, we do have some poo poo here. Yes, hello girls, good morning. Good morning. Here you go. Yes. And we'll take a swing around there. Watch him fight. Let's see if we can find Amos around here. Well, he'll be crowing here in a little bit. Yes. Look how nice and healthy they look. Let's throw him some corn here. Corn and scratch grains and all sorts of neat stuff. And they're way, way over there. Uh oh, there's my boy. There's my boy. There's my boy. There's Amos. He is the top dog. He is the top dog. He is the top dog here. And he knows it. I have this tree right here. This tree right here is a crab apple. And the girls are just loving the... They're just loving it when... Uh, the blooms are falling off. They just chase it all down. Yes. And they just love that stuff. It's a nice sweet treat for them. It sure is. I don't know how old this tree is, but I know it's old. Well, hello, sweetheart. There's another pretty girl, and there's a few more. I don't beak none of my birds. I don't believe it's uh, natural for a bird to be uh, de-beaked. I, I find it wrong, and I also find it very cruel. Well, hello! Let's look at your legs, seeing how you're up here. 
Yes, look at that. Nice, healthy looking birds, don't you think? Oh yes, you're going to be laying an egg here this afternoon, aren't you? Yes, you are. Yes, you are. I always like to look at my birds in the morning. Of course, they keep on trying to get my coffee every single day. I don't know what they like about coffee, but... There's another young man. He's gonna be leaving us tomorrow. Yep, I'm gonna... He's gonna be, uh, he's gonna become a show chicken. That's a perfect white rock right there. Yes. Very good looking boy. Young, young. He's still a cockerel. He is probably, I'm going to say, six months old. And here's my other cockerel right there. Look at him. He's leaving tomorrow too. Hate to see him go. He is also a nice pretty boy, isn't he? Nice looking feet. Aren't you? You're just a handsome boy. Yes, you are. Yes, you are. And you girls. This is a sex link here. There's Marion. I call her Marion. She is one of the old Sussex that we have. <laughs> She's about four years old and still laying nice eggs. I don't have many names for the girls, but the ones I recognize right away have a name. Don't you? Whoa, what are you doing back up here? Huh?
See how nice and shiny their eyes are? No snot flowing out of their nostrils. Come on, show us that pretty face. There you go. Show us that pretty face. You are going to be a nice looking rooster when you get older. Yes, he is. Come on now, no fighting. No, I got more than enough grain here. I got more than enough. Okay, I'll throw some more on the table. Jeez, you don't have to sit there and fight over it. I've never seen any, anybody act like they've been starving to death around here. They all act like they're starving. All of them. Oh, aren't you a pretty looking girl? Look at you. Well, Amos, aren't you gonna jump on the table? Come on, Amos. He is just a little over a year old. He controls this whole thing. He is a top dog and he knows it. Hello, pretty girl. I like to do this all the time. I like to come out here, look at the girls, see how they're doing. Make sure none of them are sick. Yep. I gotta make them another compost pile. I gotta rake everything up again so they can knock it all down for me. The blooms fall off this tree and they are just on there like you wouldn't believe. Almost like a worm falling. Well, hello, little one. Yes, this is one of my older hens. I would say this one is probably close to maybe four years old. Look at how nice and healthy she is. This is on an all natural grain diet. I don't feed my birds pellets or uh, the uh, crumbles. Even though, I mean, the crumbles aren't bad or neither are the uh, pellets. I just prefer an all natural grain. Wish the sun was out shining on their feathers. You could see how pretty they really are. But it's overcast and there's nothing I can do about that. But yes, they are very pretty girls. Very pretty girls. Aren't ya? Yes. Well, people, I hope you had a nice look at my girls and some of the boys. And of course, we finally got Amos in on the picture. Okay, everybody, you take care. Bye-bye then.